It hurts when someone leaves us. Those we love become a part of us. When a loved one leaves, a part of us is ripped out and a hole is left and a wound. The healing of these wounds takes time, a lot of time. Those were the words of Pastor Nathan Brandis of Emmanuel Baptist Church in Morris, who spoke at Thursday's annual Shining Lights Memorial Service at the church. The program, which has been held for over 20 years, is presented by the Red River Valley Palliative Care Program. Coordinator Holly Rafferty talks about the purpose behind the event. We have always felt that it's nice to have a chance to stop and before the Christmas season gets busy for people to share remembrance of people who passed in the community and honor them and just deal with that loss a little bit before they get into the busyness of the holidays and make some decisions of whether what they can attend and what they wish not to that they they have to acknowledge their grieving at the same time. Over the years, families have donated Christmas lights that have been strung up at four different spots around town, including the corner of Highway 23 and 75, the Morris Hospital, the Morris Museum, and the Red River Valley Lodge. The lights will stay lit until Epiphany in early January. People, of course, in the very darkness of winter will be able to look, notice them very much over the evenings and nights through the Christmas season and know that they're all in memory of community people that have been part of our lives in the past. For PeminaValleyOnline.com, I'm Corey Canute.